Ladies and gentlemen, this is IRC News and I'm Joey Steven, an authorized Canadian immigration practitioner, bringing out this special edition of Federal CIC immigration release. This news was released by the Canadian government on 6th of June 2023. I'm coming to you from the Paulins Studios in Cambridge, Ontario. Today is the 9th of June 2023. Canada is a destination of choice for people looking to visit, do business, or reunite with family and friends. That's why the Canadian government is committed to improving our immigration programs and services by making them more efficient and equitable for people around the world. The Honourable Minister of Immigration, Sean Fraser, uh, refugees and citizenship announced the addition of 13 more countries for the ETA authorization, electronic travel authorization program. Travelers from these countries who have either held a Canadian visa in the past 10 years or who currently hold a valid US non-immigrant visa can now apply for an ETA instead of a visa when traveling to Canada by air. Effective today, eligible travelers from these countries can benefit from the program. Antigua and Barbuda, Argentina, Costa Rica, Morocco, Panama, Philippines, St. Kitts and Nevis, St. Lucia, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Shisars, Thailand, Trinidad and Tobago, Uruguay. Okay, introducing visa-free travel, uh, air travel, also makes it faster, easier, and more affordable for thousands of travelers to visit Canada for up to six months for either business or leisure. It will also help grow Canada's economy by facilitating more travel, tourism, and international business, and by strengthening Canada's relationship with these countries while keeping Canadians safe. This decision will also divert thousands of applicants from Canada's visa caseload, allowing Canada to process visa applications more efficiently, which will benefit all visa applicants. Individuals who already have a valid visa can continue to use it to travel to Canada. Those who are not eligible for an ETA or who are traveling to Canada by means other than air, okay, by bus or car or train or boat, uh, will still need a visitor visa. Travelers can visit canada.ca slash ETA to find out whether they are eligible for a ETA and how to apply for one. If you need assistance to participate in Canadian provincial or federal programs or assistance after selection, please contact us, myar.me slash contact dash us. Good luck. This federal news video is brought to you by IRC News. Please subscribe to this channel for more Canadian job opportunities, data analysis, and immigration news. If you want to become a Canadian permanent resident, you can learn more by attending the free online YouTube videos, the links of which are now posted on your screen, polincis.com slash p. Your Canadian authorized representative also conducts a free weekly Q&A session every week on Fridays. For time and Zoom meeting credentials, please visit this website or which you can see on your screen, myar.me. Please follow guidance from the Canadian government about who can charge fees for Canadian immigration services. The redirect link which you can see on, on your screen now, polincis.co slash rep will lead you there. If you want to obtain a free 
multiple approaches Canadian PR evaluation directly from a Canadian authorized representative, then myar.me slash evaluation xx can assist you. Also, feel free to visit your our social media platforms on Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube. From all of us at IRC News and especially from your Paulinsis team, we thank you for watching. If you like this news, please like this video. And if you want to receive notifications about more Canadian job positions, then please subscribe to this channel. But life still goes on. I want some help, palances, palances, palances by my side. I don't Get to make it on my